If you're like me, you're in the middle class looking for secure investments. You want stable, non-fluctuating returns. You want passive income that's manageable come tax season. My 401k and my retirement don't give me the returns I'm looking for. I want to get into commercial real estate. I'll be honest with you. But I'm not an accredited investor. In enters CRE2U.com, CRE2U.com, with tenant and common real estate deeds. Think fractional ownership of long-term, single-tenant, triple-net lease properties with corporate guarantees. Go to CRE2U.com, your gateway to commercial real estate. If you're talking progress, it's like a snail's pace. This ha- I mean, I'm telling you, like, basically what's happening right now, the BYU football program is, like, burning down. And instead of urgently running in there and trying to put the fires out, I see guys just sort of walk around looking at the fire going, ah, it'll burn out eventually, and we'll get things turned around. No, it's going to burn down to the ground, and then you're not going to have anything. He just takes things too far, and he gets on his own. He's, he does. He lives in right field all by himself. He beats to the beat of his own drum, and he is just one of a kind. He is an enigma, Brady Pupinga. But, yeah, he, I think he takes things a little too far. A little too far. The program's not in a good state right now. I don't think we need to burn it to the ground. I, I mean, changes need to be made. You know, going back to St. Louis, like that year, we went 2-14, 2011 St. Louis, and I criticized, just amongst the other players, one of the things that our D coordinator said to us every week. I mean, we'd get donkey stomps every week, and our D coordinator, they wouldn't make any changes. We'd run the same defense. They'd play the same players. We'd go out there and get stomped again. You know, mm-hmm. finish the season 2-14, and 14, last in the NFL, and um, the D coordinator, he would say – you know, something along the lines of, well, boys, we just have to keep chopping wood. We just got to go out <laughs> there and just keep chopping wood. And I was like, I would say, you know, there's that quote, like, it's the definition of insanity to do the same thing and expect different results. So back to BYU, yeah, something's got to change. Like, the results suck. So if you just keep doing the same thing, you're probably going to get the same sucky results. So, yeah, they need to change something. You just listened to a Cougar Sports minicast brought to you by CRE2U.com, your gateway to commercial real estate. For the entire interview, go to ESPN960sports.com or to our iTunes podcast feed.